Don't camp! Don't camp! Play the game! Play the goddamn game! Stop camping, kid! What's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel Escape Edwin here. Today, we're gonna have a nice video. So basically, I was going through the item shop, making sure there was nothing new. And there were two new packs that came out. Oh, one of them being Battle Hardened, but honestly, it's not a pack that I really am interested in. Uh, it's an AR, it's a um, Marksman, and nothing too good. Then this one, Battle Ready, but there's no uh, blueprints or anything. There's just a skin and finishing move, and I don't know. It's something I'm not going to use. So, and then I noticed this one, the Kimball Pack Executor. Executor. I don't know how to fucking pronounce that word, you know? All right, so whatever it is, but they have this pistol in it, and I was just looking at it, and it looks so similar to the platinum one. So I'm thinking, hey, 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 yo, 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 guys, y'all made me grind so much to get the fucking platinum pistols when I could just fucking bought one. So that's what we're gonna be doing today. Today we're gonna be testing out the executioner. Uh, it's a handgun Bravo. Uh, it's a legendary blueprint. Uh, basically, it's a, a Kimbo, 10 round mag, match grade trigger. 5 milliwatt laser and a muzzle break so we're gonna see it out in game and see how it looks like so i'm gonna purchase it right now and then we're gonna see it in game so this is called executioner so i'm gonna put in my loadout i'm probably gonna be rocking the right shield with it just so you know so i can have some back protection but i'm not gonna use the right shield so let me put in a loadout and then we'll use it in game and tell you guys if it's worth it or not it cost 800 cod points so it wasn't that much i mean it's still eight dollars but you know it's not that much compared to the weapon so you do get a nice handgun so we're gonna see how it feels and how it looks like in game so let me go to my loadout and then i'll show you guys what it looks like all right guys so here we have the this is the handgun bravo this is the one that the pack is the executioner so as you guys see is the 1911 this is the the base one and here we have the executioner so as we do see it is the, it does lose accuracy we do gain damage range stays the same fire rate it's upgraded a lot and mobility decreases a little control still the same so let's see the actual gun all right so here we have a muzzle break uh it has recoil stabilization uh, here is the default this is the executioner it basically makes it a little bit more shiny that's the only difference it has the five milliwatt laser uh, this is better for hip fire accuracy and sprint to fire accuracy to make it really fast. Uh, I would normally go with attack, but since we have the Kimbo, then there's no point for ADS, honestly. Uh, it has the trigger action. It has the match grade trigger, which is better for fire rate and aiming stability. It does lose in hip fire accuracy, where I would prefer lightweight trigger because match grade is not the best. See this radar, this executioner. It does make it does make it like a little bit more stainless steel looking like um like i said mostly like if it were me i would change these type of things i'm not going to change it because i want to show it off in the way it was bought you know i don't want to add m things to make it better i want to show it how it came from the store ammunition has a 10 round mag like i said 15 round mag would be for me the execute this is the default one executioner it's more clearer and has that chrome part so as you guys can see that's the default executioner and for perk we're going to be rocking the kimbo um so here we have the regular one with nothing at all here we have gold here we have platinum platinum nothing platinum nothing you see what i'm saying is that it looks very similar like look 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 this is a platinum one the nothing one like it still has that shine it's not as shiny but what i'm saying is that like in game you're not really gonna see if it's platinum or not see with the masses here you can see it gold it looks like it like any other spray paint you can see it you get me like any other camo look at many camos many camos and then we get to completionist gold and you're like what the fuck it looks like the same shit so yeah we're gonna be rocking the nun because i want to show it to you so, yeah so here's what i'm gonna be rocking double time restock amp c4 stim uh, the executioner and the right shield so let's get in the game of dirty old houseboat and let's see how this gun is it's in the kimbo uh 1911 i've actually never rocked the kimbo 1911 if i'm being honest 
I only rock the camo for you know the snake shots, the three five sevens, and the, now the Renettis. It's actually pretty fun. I've been using the Renettis a lot lately. That's been my go-to. Uh, pistol now that they nerfed the snake shots. So. Yeah. And today's flavor of the day we have GPO Great. Um, my first time actually trying the grape flavor. I actually never have tried the grape flavor. Hopefully it's good. Uh, I usually try the watermelon and that's my go-to. But I bought a shit ton of G Fuel lately. Like I made a huge ass order. So you know I want to taste different flavors, see what's my favorite one. And from there choose which one I want for a tub. Uh, I have like two tubs, but one of the flavors it's not I don't really like it that much. Alright, so in game it doesn't look like the platinums too much. As you guys can see, they kind of look black. But it can't. It could be. Sometimes this map uh, actually does this glitch. For, I've re I realized in oh shit. I realized in this map most a lot of times uh, it, it like shows it that you don't have the ammo. The the oh shit. Oh, with this map sometimes it doesn't really show the. Um, What's it called? The weapon wrap. Right here. <laughs> Look at this shit. He stuck it on me. <laughs> it's just like against other akimbo pistols like, i really don't think this this really stands out too much or like it's uh impactful you get me like i'm like the uh, akimbo snake shots you know they were the akimbo snake shots they were like fucking everyone using them, you get me or now with the akimbo renetis it's something that a lot of people also use as well you know it's like come that so I just don't think that this really has the same thing to it. Thing is. Can't do shit. Can't do shit. He really can't. Dude, what can you fucking do? What can you fucking do, kid? <laughs> I got you. What was he using? Man? I just want to pick up his gun. This is the mask? No, that was like some black shit. <laughs> that was so funny. I just scared the shit out of him. I'm not gonna use a right shot, so. I don't know why, but every time I get a kill with the right shot, I always just laugh. I'm doing the fucking the mask is going for it. I, I don't know, I can never take the right show seriously. Like, when I see a, a four doing the fucking right show, like only grinding the right show, like, I do that in fucking show at this point. I think that a lot of people are now are more using the, the fire shotguns, like the Dragon's Breath and the Caldera. Uh, I remember when they first came out, like, now a lot of people, you know, bought them or use them because it was kind of weird. But honestly, they're like my favorite guns. The only thing about bad thing is they don't really have that much range, or you can't really customize it that much. But like, I think once you use the dragon's breath, it, like, it limits on what what else what attachments you can have. Oh, oh my God, that was beautiful. It smells like um grape Kool Aid. Okay, that actually tastes really good. Like I think grape flavor has become my favorite flavor. I think they just look black in game. Yeah, I don't think they even look platinum at all. Hey, fuck you. The other engine that could. The other fucking engine that could. Why did you not shoot him, you fucking idiot? Oh my god. I fucking spawn next to him. I wanna kill that guy. That's my mission for right now. Just kill him. And go. <laughs> fuck you, little piece of shit. I'm I'm waiting for you, kid. I'm waiting for you. Oh. Ah, oh, fuck. That's why I said why I want the more ammo on this gun. It doesn't give me enough ammo. 
But like it gives me like very little like 10 bullets is not enough Especially in this type of map. I would probably prefer Around it. Come here, teammate. Oh my god. Holy fuck. <laughs> I'm not gonna use a right yet, so. Alright. You're not camping, kid. I'm not gonna give you those. Don't camp! Don't camp! Play the game! Play the goddamn game! Stop camping, kid! Campers here! Campers! Stop camping! Ah, oh, fuck. That's horrible. That would be most horrible. Alright, so... Honestly... The game's not worth it. I wouldn't buy it. If I could get my refund back, I would, but I didn't, so. Fucking stupid. But, I mean, there's nothing wrong with the gun. It's just there's so many better options. I'm not saying it's a bad gun or it's not fun to have, but I'm just saying, if you want to get better, you know, better gameplay or better, get better at the game, this gun's not the way to go. Like, I would never rock this gun. 1911 is just a gun that I, I don't really like using at all. Not a lot of people really like using, to be honest, if I'm being, like, sincerely honest. Not a lot of people really would rock it. And you know the Kimbo like it's not it's not the best with this gun, you know? It's it it's good. Uh, you guys saw me get some kills there. I mean I mean so you do get kills with it, but it's just there's way better options, you know. I know they nerfed the snake shots, but that still is way better than this shit. You could use the Renettis if you want like a pistol without the snake shot, um without the snake shot shit, you know, like if you want to use like the regular reticle. Use the snake shots. I'll, I've even used the Akimbo on the Deagles, and they played better than this shit. So honestly, this gun, I mean, it's 800, and you know, when I was looking at it, I basically bought it because it looked exactly like the Platinum. So it would make me think, oh, should I have the Platinum? But it looks nothing like the Platinum. In game, this shit looks black. It's only in this screen where this looks like shiny, you, you see? Aside from that, it just looks black, so... It just looks like a black pistol, nothing special about it. There's nothing really good about it. Probably the only perk it has, to be honest, is the fact that I unlocked the Kimbo with it. Aside from that, there's nothing else that I would that would make me relatively even want to use this gun. So yeah. It's a no-go for me. The executioner pack. Don't 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 get it, guys. It's it's not good. It's not worth it. Save your money by nerd pack, you know? Get a tracer pack or some shit like that. But yeah, that's it for this video. This gun's not worth it and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys liked it, please uh, chuck a like down below. And please subscribe to my channel, Escape Edwin, where I do a lot of cool videos. Um, Mostly Call of Duty now, uh, but of course, every once in a while, I'll go to Valorant or Fortnite. Uh, I'll go to GTA, but, you know, Call of Duty is like the game I'm, I'm, I feel really good at, you know? Um, you know, if you want to see more blueprint packs like this shit, uh, if they're worth or not, you know, just comment down below what blueprint pack you want me to do, and I'll do it for you, you know? Um yeah and i mean i have pretty dope gameplay it's pretty funny so yeah subscribe to my channel like this video comment down below what blueprint pack you want me to unlock next and yeah go check out the videos here oh i try to post i'll try to post every day you know so hopefully i can post every day if not but like every two days i'll still post so yeah thank you guys for watching this video and peace out